The toxic nitric oxide is acting as a signaling molecule in some bacteria, plants and animals. In animals, the nitric oxide causes the relaxation of smooth muscle cells in the wall of the blood vessel. Before looking into the molecular mechanism behind the nitric oxide mediated relaxation of smooth muscle cells in the wall of the blood vessel, we should first know about the anatomy of a blood vessel. The cross section of an animal's blood vessel contains many layers of smooth muscle cells which forms its outer layer. Below the smooth muscle cell layers, a basal lamina is present. And below the basal lamina, a layer of endothelial cells is present. This endothelial cell layer line the interior of the blood vessel. And lastly, the autonomic nerves are supplied to the wall of the blood vessel. In animals, the nitric oxide synthesis or NOS catalyzes the production of nitric oxide. Different types of cells in animal produces differently named NOS. The NOS in the endothelial cells is called as ENOS. The macrophages produce INOS or inducible NOS. These NOS are named as such because macrophages make them only when they are activated or induced by an infection. The NOS in the neuron and myocytes is called as NNOS. Now let us talk about the molecular mechanism behind the nitric oxide mediated relaxation of smooth muscle cells in the wall of the blood vessel. At first, the activated autonomic nerve terminal releases the neurotransmitter acetylcholine. The acetylcholine binds to the G protein linked receptor present on the endothelial cell. This binding activates the phosphoinositide signaling pathway producing IP3 or inositol triphosphate. The IP3 induces endoplasmic reticulum or ER to release its stored calcium ions. Then the calcium ion binds to the calmodulin and form a complex. This complex stimulates ENOS. Then the stimulated ENOS catalyzes a deamination reaction in which the amino acid arginine produces nitric oxide and citrulline. The gas nitric oxide then diffuses rapidly across the membranes and reaches to the cytosol of the adjacent smooth muscle cell and binds to the cytosolic enzyme guanylyl cyclase. This binding activates guanylyl cyclase. Then the activated guanylyl cyclase catalyzes a biochemical reaction in which the GTP produces cyclic GMP. As a result, the cyclic GMP concentration increases. This cyclic GMP acts as a second messenger. This increase in cyclic GMP concentration activates the protein kinase G. This activated protein kinase G catalyzes a biochemical reaction in which appropriate muscle protein produces phosphorylated muscle protein. As a result, the smooth muscle cells get relaxed which causes dilation of blood vessel. Now the nature of nitric oxide. Nitric oxide is hydrophobic and small enough to pass rapidly across cell's plasma membrane. 
nitric oxide acts only locally because its half life is about 5 to 10 seconds functions of nitric oxide nitric oxide released by autonomic nerves in the penis causes local blood vessel dilation that is responsible for penile erection nitric oxide is produced by activated macrophages and neutrophils to help them to kill invading microorganisms in plants the nitric oxide causes defensive responses to injury or infection another molecule agonist to nitric oxide is carbon monoxide which acts by activating guanylyl cyclase please subscribe like and press the bell icon to see more videos on my channel.